If you're looking for coins for packs or players like you see on the screen, visit my friends at thegamekeys.co.uk. Use Nick at checkout for 5% off all of your PlayStation, Microsoft, or PC coin orders. What's up, you beauties? Welcome to a very old series that I've been getting so much demand to bring back. Now, if you're new to the channel, or you know what, really, 90% of you guys probably didn't even see this series. I had this series going on back when I had like anywhere from the beginning of my YouTube to about 10, maybe 15,000 subscribers. We're down near 50,000 subscribers boys so thank you so much first of all for clicking that subscribe button I do appreciate it for watching and liking my videos as well and I hope you enjoy this series if you haven't seen it before now the concept to this series originally was I take a league and I build a full club team from that league and try to win the gold cup and I start from A to Z now go watch the past videos I've done Arsenal I've done Aston Villa I've done Chelsea among others and it's pretty damn tough to try and do well in the gold cup with a full club team now the Chelsea team did incredibly well and if I used it now it would do even better with all of the informs and team of the season that the team has so I'm a little bit worried with my Everton setup to be fully honest with you they do have quite a few decent informs and team of the seasons as well and just to make note boys I know that there's an informed stones but he is a silver and i want to try and go with the highest rated team that i can go with so if you couldn't tell from the title this week is everton boys we're going to try and build a best possible everton team now i know a lot of you guys may look at this and be like well nick everton uses a 4-2-3-1 why don't you use that I try to force teams into formations that I use in game. I love 4-3-3 false 9 and I love 4-4-2 with the CDMs. So most of my teams are going to be built around that. So as I pick the midfielders as well, I'm not going to go with Darren Gibson. I'm actually going to go with McCarthy and the man himself. Ross Barkley. I love this card. I love the inform silver version of this card. So we'll try and take on the gold cup with this team and the video will be as long as how many games I get. It could be a hell of a lot longer if I actually win the gold cup because that means four games with potentially extra time or it could be a little bit shorter if I get knocked out within the first or second game of the tournament. And then right at the end of the episode guys I will also give you guys kind of a quick overview of the team who I think did well who I think did poorly etc etc. Now there there is no left wing or decent enough left wing for Everton so I want to push Kevin Morales to a left winger he'll get seven chemistry which I'm okay with everyone else is on 10 chem pretty excited about certain players I've used pretty much every single player in this team quite a bit I built an Irish team where McCarthy featured and Aiden McGeady Seamus Coleman's team of the season is one of my favorite right backs in the game etc etc the one card that I'm scared shitless of is the card that you guys would all look at and be like fuck he's gonna be incredible regular Tim Howard is honestly one of my favorite BPL keepers. I have used this card, not this one because I had to rebuy it, but I have used this card specifically for about 15 to 20 games before I sold them on and it was a horror show. Can't believe I sold them for 100k and I had to buy them for 600 plus thousand. Ridiculous. And there's the team built all with chemistry styles and the bench as well has Everton players that I might use in case of emergency. The one I really want to try out is Gerard Delafeu. He was great last year. I haven't really used him this year. All right, let's go boys. Wish me luck. How far can we go let me know in the comments right now how far did you think this Everton team would go in the gold cup all right round of 16 what the f Fuck, okay. Well, I guess Everton got lucky in the round of 16. Now, fingers crossed I actually do well. This team is 35 chemistry. Come on, man. If I get knocked out in the round of 16, I suck. What a pass from Romelu. Oh, this lag is OP. Nice. One more. Oh, mama! Oh, come on! Get it in the net! What the fuck? That's a penalty! Wow! Holy shit, boys. I know it's 15 minutes in. Crazy lag, and I don't know if I've shown it in the replays or in the video earlier, but holy shit, this guy is surviving somehow, getting all the bounces. I didn't think I was going to get this as a penalty, but that's good stuff. Definitely going to let Leighton Baines take this. I'm sure Everton fans would have been like, yeah, Nick, please let him have this. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh! And Goodison Park is jumping, boys. Not as bad as this guy's fucking connection. Holy shit, is it bad, though. Take a hit here. Holy Leighton Baines! That was not bad! Oh, Baines is on a run. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm going to hit this for no reason. Baines, 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 please! Oh, Leighton Baines makes these crazy runs. Where the hell? Like, Leighton Baines is just everywhere. See that run? Oh, mama. Ross Barkley. Oh, Ross! Ross Barkley! Oh, freaking prick. 
What the fuck is Leighton Baines doing at center forward? I mean, it's not that I don't like it. Holy shit, that's what he's doing at center forward. Oh my god. Leighton Baines, son. That's two goals. Center forward? What the fuck was he even doing there? Look at this. The ball popped up to him. I'm like, what the actual hell? Let's crack. Oh, that left foot of dreams. Well, I think we've discovered just how OP the team of the season Leighton Baines is. Oh my god, man. That was the most fun I've had with a left back bar none. And I will have you guys know that I used to rate team of the season Alaba and then inform Marcelo as my top two, but I swear Leighton Baines has pushed himself into the number two spot. It's gotta be now team of the season Alaba, Team of the season, Baines, and then in for Marcelo for my top three left backs in the game. And just to quickly show you the dominance, boys, 15 shots, 56% possession. His team, for some fucking reason, just would not concede goals. Okay, so quarterfinals. What are we seeing here? Holy shit. Okay. Now it's getting serious, boys. Four triple two, strong formation. It's a good team. The CDMs, although they're good players, I think I might be able to take advantage of the CDMs. Oh, Kevin Morales, take advantage of that fuck up. Boom, there we go, Kevin Morales. And boy, oh boy, did we make him pay. Now, I don't know if he was trying to fuck around, actually, or his players just glitched out. But either way, Kevin Morales took advantage. That is beautiful. Well done, son. Come on, Lukaku. McGeady's on a run. Oh my gosh, that's a little audacious, but McGeady hit! Oh, Mother Teresa! Look at this! That's not even a realistic law, but Midgidi just takes it on the run and crushes it! One more time for good measure. What a hit, my man! Ross Barkley! Oh! I've said it time and time again, guys. Ross Barkley's card, his informed silver card, regular gold card are incredible. Uh oh. Oh, come on. That is at fault of Leighton Baines. More my fault than anything because I tried to do an idiotic little fake shot there with Leighton Baines and paid for it with a goal. And there we go, boys, into the semi-final against much harder opposition. I gotta say, I'm actually very impressed by this Everton team. They're playing well. Romelu Lukaku still has not scored, which is a bit worrisome, so I don't know what to do there. Maybe I'll give Aruna Kone a chance, and maybe I'll sub in Romelu Lukaku's in for him if I need more heading prowess on the field at halftime or something. And stats, although I had a bit more possession, a bit more shooting, I think that was actually a pretty even game in terms of how we played. He was very good at holding possession. I'm not entirely sure how I had more possession to to be honest. But anyways, on to the semi-final. All right, semi-final, and that's what I'm fucking dealing with. Holy shit. The best part is this guy's club name is FIFA is a joke, and then the team name is Dirty. That is a dirty team. Really nice team. So there's the halftime whistle, guys. I don't even know if I even showed you guys anything from the first half. Not much to see. Very cagey, just back and forth. A few chances here and there. Most of our shots were just hope and pray shots from distance, so... Ugh. On to the second half. He's gonna fucking hit this? No way. Oh my god! With Zlatan! What the actual fucking hammer of Thor was that? There's no way I can get mad at that shot. What a hit, man. He deserved to win the game from that goal. Okay, we're on ultra attacking now, so... That's it! That's it! Yes! Seamus Coleman fights off his Felipe Luiz. What a cross. Romelu Lukaku, the substitution of dreams. Thank goodness. Instantly replied. Bit of scripting? Probably. That's probably the game winner. Fuck, dude. All that pressure in the last 15 minutes, whether you guys saw it or not, and uh, he just gets a stray freaking header that goes in. Oh my god! Chip him! Chip him! <laughs> oh! For Look at him! Caught him! What the fuck? Check! Piss off! Oh, boys, come on. Come on, corner cheese. That's it! Yeah! <laughs> You're probably only seeing these goals, boys, but I've been destroying this guy for pressure. Check 
for him has come up massively. I feel like I deserve at least the draw here out of this game going into extra time. Oh, nice cut in. Oh my god. He's gonna cut in one more time probably. Yeah, game over. Oh my god, dude. What a simple goal to score. Is it gonna give me another chance? No, it's not. No way! Oh my god, Petter check! It's a great ball in! I just what the fuck? <laughs> wow! 3-3! Three, three. I just I, I have no words, man. It, like the the actual header doesn't go in. No, it's gotta be an insane rebound that everyone falls over. Oh Sylvan, Distin! I have no idea what's happening right now, guys. How is this 3-3? Three, three? Lukaku? Oh, Lukaku! Oh my god, Gerard Delafeu Lukaku cuts in, gets himself a hat trick in extra time! Oh my goodness, you Everton fans, you boys better be proud! Ross? Hit it, Ross Barkley? Holy fuck! Ross Barkley, without a doubt, is a gem of this team. I cannot believe that we're potentially going into the final. I am so impressed by this Everton team, boys. A hat-trick for Romelu Lukaku. I guess I'll leave him as a substitute. He seems to like that more. On to the final, boys! Can Everton win the fucking Gold Cup for us? All right, loading into the final. 86 rated. Holy shit, boys! silent there because i'm like you know what i'm gonna swing it across it's cheese boys but cup final with everton versus legends i'll take that goal oh my god why the fuck would you play that up the top of the box i never asked you to do that come on man as if this guy needed help oh mcgeedy 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 keep going why the Fuck does Marcelo catch up with Aiden McGeady? He had like 10 yards! Alright, time to bring on Lukaku and Gerard Delafeu. The first half was very cagey. Nothing really went on other than our two goals, to be honest. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I just have no options. What am I doing, man? It's hard enough to get a chance. Instead of shooting it, I sit there and pussyfoot with the ball. Oh yeah, I sweat incoming. Sweat OP. Oh my god, Leighton Baines. What a header away. These boys, wow, Leighton Baines is on fucking fire right now. Come on, man. Oh my god. Hit it, Lukaku! Oh, how do you fucking miss that to me that's a surefire goal man come on Romelu it's fucking painful Lukaku's going from having an incredible game to having now an absolute fucking nightmare that's a lot to ask for him to score that but still who the fuck is catching goddamn team of the season Seamus Coleman what a pass though from Aruna Kone please please oh I didn't McGeady Please, 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 no keeper charge. Lukaku, please! Fucking shit, I should have lobbed it. Gareth Barry? Oh, come on! Wow, dude, come on, man. It's the goddamn Gold Cup, bro. I'm not a legend team. This might be the last break. Oh, come on, ref! Let me have one break there! Well, that's a little disappointing, boys. I felt like I could at least maybe push that to extra time, but it just wasn't falling for me. Not much to even see in the replays in general. It was just cagey. I've said that a lot this episode, but it really was. Just back and forth. Nothing really definitive in terms of chances. And there we go, eliminated in the frickin' final. What can you do, boys? What can you do? And there's the end of the episode, boys. If you enjoyed it, please smash the like button. It would really, really, really help me out. Let me know that you like it. Let me know that the effort that goes into this type of a video is worth it because 
This video takes about two hours to two and a half hours to record, then about an hour and a half to two hours to edit. I know you think, oh, what? I'm just looking at highlights. It takes a long time to get me to this part of the video. As you can see, the video is pretty damn long. So four to five hours to edit, get this video ready for you guys. Show me some support by smashing the like button. As always, you beauties, have yourselves a great day. And the next team that is up is Fulham. Oh my. If you want to see that, let me know in the comments. Let me know any players I should use that have an inform that I might not think of using. And we'll catch you beauties on the flip side. Peace!